I hope you're well. Welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, my name is Seppi. Welcome to another weekly vlog. I'm so excited to bring you guys along with what I get up to this week. You guys have been really enjoying the vlog, so I need so much to me when you guys leave a positive comments down below and subscribing. And if you do like my vlogs, please give it a thumbs up so I film more of them. I'm just going to be bringing you along on my week. I'm going to work and chilling with my family and everything that I get up to. I thought I would start off by talking about Valentine's Day, which is just around the corner. I think this year is going to be different to every other year. Obviously, in London, it's lockdown in the UK. Um, so we're going to be having to do things at home with our loved ones. And um, whether you're single or you're in a relationship or there's someone that you really want to treat, I really want to show you guys some pieces that I picked up from Ana Luisa. I worked with them loads of times before. You guys will probably have seen them in my vlogs. But they're running a huge Valentine's Day sale. 50 15% off their jewellery and I just think jewellery is such an incredible gift to give for Valentine's Day It's something that lasts you a lifetime and it was something that I really um, Look forward to wearing I have so many sentimental pieces in my jewellery box And I just think it's such a great way to show someone some love and appreciation Especially with all the difficult stuff that's going on in the world right now It's nice to just kind of take your mind off things with some jewellery So they have a huge sale going on right now 15% off First item I want to show you I'm actually wearing I was wearing it for some pictures I was taking for Instagram and I absolutely love it I wear it on my pinky and it's this ring this gold ring and it is like a double ring almost it's so gorgeous with Ana Luisa rings you can basically pick the size so that it fits anything that you like I picked the smallest size on the website so that I can have this like a pinky ring and you can layer it with loads of different rings or you can just have it simple by itself which for me is so effective I've paired them with these gold hoops which are actually from Ana Luisa as well from a previous collaboration but this is just how I wore my outfit today at home in my comfy little loungewear. I'm going to show you guys a couple more pieces that I really love to maybe give you guys some inspiration for gift ideas. Next up I have these earrings. They're these gorgeous double hooped kind of diamante style earrings. I love wearing earrings like this to work all the time so I think that these are a fabulous piece and also if you have your hair up in a slick back pony and you want like some little minimal statement hoops I think these ones are so nice because they have the diamantes in them. I'm just going to pop them on to show you guys. Et voila! How beautiful is that? I absolutely love these. They are so gorgeous. Wow they're even more beautiful on. I love that one hoop is diamante and the other one is like plain. I just think it looks like almost like a little calf. It's so adorable these are definitely joining my favorite hoops i love the size of them as well i love like mini hoops and i just think these are such a nice twist on the classic simple hoop earrings and the last item i wanted to show you was this necklace i love by the way that all of the Ana Luisa jewelry comes in these little pouches and their brand is 100 percent carbon neutral as well um so you feel good doing the shopping from there this is the last item that I picked up and it's this gorgeous emerald colored pendant uh, necklace. I recently saw Olivia Jade back on YouTube and she was wearing a necklace just like this. So when I was kind of picking out items for myself to remind myself how much I love myself this Valentine's Day, I was like, I definitely want this. I love Olivia Jade's jewelry and I'm also really happy she's back on Instagram, back on YouTube guys. So yeah, I this is definitely inspired by her. So it comes with this really nice chain and I would wear it over a polar neck top like this and I could layer it with a few necklaces or I could just wear it by itself with kind of a low cut top in summer as well and I just think it would be so adorable. This piece is so cute and you guys know me, I love gold jewellery so for me I would wear all three of these together happily and I just think they would be such pretty gifts. The link for Ana Luisa will be down in the description if you guys want to shop any of these. Like I said, they're 15% off, so you guys can definitely take advantage of the sale. Now I'm going to take you guys down, let's go and see what is for dinner. I am so hungry, can't even begin to explain. Guys, I need to show you, but don't want to show you my bedroom. It's actually becoming inhabitable because of the amount of clothes that are just everywhere. And I need to try and convince my dad to let me turn the spare bedroom into a closet because I just don't have enough space. But we will see what we do. I also need to clear out a lot of clothes to give away to like charity. So yeah, guys, give me like ideas about storage and stuff like that because it's not going well for your sister out here. She is struggling. 
And in case you were wondering how I did my makeup today, um, it's part of a video that is coming this week of my dad doing my voiceover. But I actually really love this mascara. If you watched two vlogs ago, I got the um, Bambi Eyes Mascara uh, from L'Oreal and it is insane. I used to use Rimmel for like literally the longest amount of time, I think like four or five years. But I've recently swapped and I love this so much. My mum is making chicken wraps for dinner, um, but in the meantime, I'm going to have one of these little Starbucks cappuccinos. Oh my god, if any of you guys have been following me for years, you'll know that I used to drink these in the library at uni. Jeez, oh my god, it feels like a lifetime ago. But I used to get the latte. Sina's got these because she has exams and she is going to be drinking them for... It's got hints of cocoa in it. Mm. She drinks them to study, basically. This tastes really good, but it kind of tastes like a mocha. So. I like the, the latte one more, but this does taste really good. I would recommend it still. Oh my god, this wrap looks delicious. It is a chicken wrap. My mum made it for her channel, Music Go Demo, so if you guys want to know the recipe, then, you know, check it out on her channel. Let me taste it. In case you guys are wondering, I did change because I'm boiling, because I just spent... 20 minutes trying to film a tiktok don't forget to follow persian underscore bunny okay this is leaking let me try mm, wow it's a mexican chicken wrap and it just tastes divine i'm gonna devour this now everyone is very full from these wraps they are literally demolished mum thank yes. you my very pleasure nice. darling um what was it mexican half of them were mexican wraps mm -hmm. i had four by the way guys i had two on my plate and then i had another two now at the table because i was just very hungry two, uh, so i had two mexican and i had two like chicken tikka wraps so she made indian style there yes. so half indian style half mexican style half mexican yeah, and you can go and have a look at Missy Gerdema, you can see the recipe. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, you can follow the recipe there. Oh my god, I've started itching. This happens to me when I eat spicy mm. food. Oops. It's really delicious. But it's worth it. Guys, my mum has come upstairs to help me with my room because it is just literally that bad that it will need two of us. Basically, it's... <laughs> I'm scared to show everyone. Don't so, <laughs> no, I need to. So... That's my Zara stuff that I wear to work. Let's not talk about the work top right now. And then this is the floor and collaboration stuff all around that. Some of which I haven't shot yet. Some of which I need to put away. And then my closet is just bulging. Like, let me show you. There is literally no space in here. It is gross how full it is. So I need to sort that out. ASAP. So let me guys update you from when you last saw the pictures in my room. It is currently 12.30 at night and I know what you're thinking. She's just spent hours cleaning and organizing her wardrobe. Nope. Soon after seeing the state of my room, I went and tried to convince my dad to let me turn the library into a walk-in wardrobe for me, um, which clearly didn't go very well. He basically said no. Uh, but we're gonna try and reorganize and reshuffle my wardrobe but we're not gonna do that today because I went into central London with my mum to, to shoot some content for the rest of the week because I am working every single day next week apart from Thursday so it was the only time I could really like I could really go and like put my 100 into it so yeah we went to central London and not gonna lie it was quite depressing how dead it was we were literally the only people in the whole of central London um so yeah it's very 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 dead up which is also reassuring to see as it is locked down but yeah kind of depressing scene as well so now i'm going to wash off my makeup sorry i really like how the screen looks with this green and i'm just a little green monkey um so i'm gonna wash off this makeup now and go to bed um i have work in the morning so i will see you <laughs> can i show the reality of music <laughs> Lord, 
team. He's got his pyjama buttons on the bottom. Yeah, <laughs> I was wearing so, a jumper and a vest under it, so I'm taking my jumper off there. Let me see her bottom half. It's her leggings. Just eye chairs. <laughs> you can change right now. Um, but how amazing is this, guys? My mum made lamb curry and it smells and looks delicious. Oh, Look at God, this. It's beautiful. Wow. And then this is with lentil rice. A la spolo. This is uh, mustard espinach, or is it yogurt and cucumber? Cucumber, sorry, mustard khiar. And then we've got salad shirazi, and then we have Indian. Um, it's not salad shirazi, it's lettuce salad. This is, yeah, so my mom's trying to make this like the Indian style of pilau rice uh, rather than the Iranian saffron it's rice. It's really delicious. It looks so good. <laughs> I took my camera to vlog at work today, but honestly, I'm just literally knackered. It's been such a busy day, so hopefully, I'll be able to show you more content tomorrow. But hello, Sol! That's all really. Mm. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna eat some food now. Update, it is 11 p.m. I just went and bought myself a Magnum. I had a two hour nap on the sofa because I was exhausted as an understatement. I was so tired that you can still see it in my eyes. But I need to edit a video. I really needed to drop something outside my friend's house. So I forced myself to um, wake up from my nap because um, I knew I had to go and drop that. And um, now I will definitely edit my video. So I've had like a two hour nap. Probably take me a few hours, but oh well. I'm very tired. Those of you guys asking about the balance of YouTube and work, sometimes it involves late nights like this. So I just got home from work and I think my makeup's lasted pretty well considering it's been under a mask the whole day. But in kind of reversal ways, I'm going to show you guys what I wore to work today before I take it off. So I'm wearing this ribbed blue Zara dress um, from my haul and I wore it with tights and a black pair of trainers. And it was just a really comfy, I'm going to for a really comfy, casual look. If it's a cold day. You can also wear a cardigan underneath and it'll be fine. Also, update on the wardrobe, wardrobe situation, guys. My mum cleared out the middle wardrobe of my shoes and put them under there. I clearly have a lot of work to do. Even looking at it makes me feel depressed. But I'm going to go get uh, undressed and have a body shower and sit down for dinner. We're having fish tonight, which I'm so happy about. Also, I just uploaded my previous vlog and you guys are writing the sweetest comments for me. I love you all so much and the comments literally make my whole day. Like, on my way home from work, I just, um, I was in the car with Sol and I was just reading the comments and it was so nice to read. So, I love you all. Thank you. Mwah. Sending you a little mwah. Wow, look at this food. This is the salad shirazi. This is the stew, Qaliya Mahi. Mom, where is this from, this stew? Is it's it from Junub Iran. Oh, so the south of Iran. And then we have some saffron rice. We have the incredible chef, Merci Mom. So your hair looks so pretty. Thank you. I did Did it you use myself. my wafer? No. Oh, how if do you, you want to see how to do it? guys go to my channel and check it out there's oh, a video i uploaded <laughs> self promo so i just washed off my makeup my skin feels really nice i've moisturized it and i am going to sit down now and eat on a scale of one to pang i mean come on the bun just makes the whole look complete also given how long my hair is my bun is just ginormous okay coming out of the bun story we're gonna start organizing this now it's my only day off my goal is to try and do it in four hours, and so how achievable do we think this goal is? Given uh, that on a scale of one to what? Achievable. <laughs> Zero. <laughs> You're so mean. Um, you know what? I read somewhere today actually that it's very therapeutic to clean and organize something. So physical organization it's very good for the mind something that you could actually do hands-on so what were you just saying about your hair i said that i colored it myself i cut layers into it myself oh show us from behind oh very nice oh, how'd you, you do it you gotta watch my videos <laughs> i literally <laughs> did my hair in under five minutes she's but... like she's like you know in little britain where they're like she's like i cut it myself i cut it myself she's like write the theme tune <laughs> sing the theme tune <laughs> if anyone grew up in england and are like a 90s baby or a 2000 baby you might remember little britain was the one 
to be fair, it was actually meant to be an adult's show. I don't I know why I was allowed to baby watch it. and I loved it. Yeah, what I meant was the youngest you can be to remember that is a, a 90s slash early, early, like 2000s baby. Pretty much. So my mum and I are going, how dry do my lips look? My mum and I are going on a road trip. Woo woo. Just, <laughs> <laughs> Just yes. joking. We are going to Boots. I need, basically need a different kind of eye drop because I feel like the other one wasn't working. If you guys watched my last vlog, then you know my eyes are a bit sore recently. So I'm trying to close the bottom, the bottom button. Um, so yeah, I need a new, like so one of my friends from work told me about an ointment version. So I just, you know, I'm gonna try to that out. Tonight you're inviting birthday party. Oh yeah, my mum's got the one year anniversary of her YouTube channel and she wants to celebrate it with a party, which is really cute. I've not actually heard of any other YouTubers doing that. So you guys are gonna come along to her party as well in this vlog. So it's actually quite an <laughs> exciting Thursday. Come on, baby, let's go party. Ah, 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 yeah. Ow, my neck I just clicked. Uh, yeah, so that's what we're gonna do. I just get so excited to go to Boots. One of my friends told me how he wa he watches my vlogs. Mom, listen to this. He was like, I watch your vlogs and um, you did like a super. He was like, I, he was like to me, oh, I watch your latest vlog. You did a super drug haul, and I was like, no, 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 no. My latest, <laughs> my latest vlog was um, a shop. All of my shopping from Waitrose, not super drug. <laughs> so yeah, that was funny. That like, um, that's how I identify by my different random hauls of what I get up to. Uh, guys, my hair is also so greasy. I've put like treatment in the back of it because I get eczema on my scalp. I'm just giving away everything that's going on with me right now. Eczema on my scalp, dry eyes. It's all happening over here. And on top of it, I look like this, this snowman vibe. It's just my latest aesthetic and it's really living for it. It's my most exciting shopping trip. I'm just trying to act nonchalant out here. Out here with my camera in boots. This boots is actually huge by the way. So guys, this is it about 80% sorted. I've also organized a lot of this wardrobe. So this is looking like a lot better. I need to obviously get rid of those books. They're going to the top shelf. And then here I literally took out a lot of my hoodies. I took out a lot of my hoodies and stuff and folded them and so it just looks a lot more like neater basically just jackets and jumpers so I thought I would show you guys my work outfit for this morning I'm wearing these Zara trousers from my Zara haul this tiger print top and then I got these new trainers from Public Desire which I absolutely love they're really cute and funky and just very plain at the same time so like super appropriate for work and this is my like work makeup so yeah it's, I'm really looking forward to my morning coffee I'm not gonna lie to you guys but I've done a really simple look by the way guys and I haven't worn that much product so I'm kind of happy with that let me know what you guys think of the more simple makeup so my dad is dropping me into work this morning and Like quite fun, like I'd get my driving shots to pick me up from from sick form. 
and um, we would like have lessons and then he would drop me outside my house. So it was like a very long winded two hour long lift home. Long. I look like an actual <laughs> egg like this. Imagine if someone saw me like this. I love the way I say that and the whole internet has just seen me like that. So I have come home, I've washed my face, it's 10.30 at night. I need to edit this vlog so that you guys can watch it tomorrow. But I'm just gonna have some dinner. How cute, my friend Nabia made me cookies. I've eaten like more than half of them, which is why it's like half empty. And it says Seppi with a smiley face. Today is Friday and I was on call until from 9 a.m. till 9.30 p.m. And Saturday and Sunday, I'm also on call 9 a.m. till 9.30 p.m and it's a different on-call shift, one that I've never done, which is covering the main hospital, wards in the main hospital. I've not done a long shift of that. I usually, like, if I do long shifts, I'm covering my own department, which is AAU. I'm kind of like, you know when it's like first day vibes, I feel a bit like that, as in I don't know what to expect, but I'm kind of like excited as well at the same time, so yeah, it's gonna be hopefully a good day, but I need to have my dinner now and edit this vlog and get a good night's sleep so that I'm super productive for tomorrow. So I'm going to end this vlog here. I hope that you guys have enjoyed it. If you didn't, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to me down below. It means so much to me when you guys do and when you leave me comments as well telling me that you're enjoying my vlogs. It honestly makes my day, especially after a long day like this. I love to come home and read your lovely messages. So thank you so much for all of them and for all of your love and support. Don't forget to check out my socials. They're always linked down below. My Instagram is Persian Bunny. My Snap is Seppi Samai and my TikTok is Persian underscore Bunny. I love you guys so much and I'll see you next time. Bye!